So today I want to show you a really really cool new browser called the Torch Browser, uh, web browser. Um, this is basically an extended version of the Google Chrome browser if you want to know that. That's why the design is so similar. But um, the, the cool thing about the extended version is that you get some really really cool extensions like the Share Media and Torrent button. The Share button basically makes you able to, uh, to share uh, whatever site you like over Facebook and Twitter, which are really cool really really cool feature added by the torch team then the media button makes you able to download whatever flash video you like no matter it's on youtube or another site as long as it's an enabled flash um then you go to the torrent button and if you want to use the torrent button or the internet created torrent client you're just gonna click torrent um gotta wait for it to load up then you got your then you just gotta add uh click on add and then uh, search for a uh, torrent file in your computer or add the at the torrent URL, so that's a really really cool feature. Also, add about Torch Team. Um, then I'm going to show you how to use uh, the integrated uh, Flash downloader. So let's find a video we want to download. So I want to download the um, MW3 video. Just gonna wait for it to load up, and then now you can see. Hey sorry, now you can see my browser edit um, on my browser detected my Flash video, so it's gonna jump on and a uh, link on video so what you basically just gonna do very simple is just you just gonna click the video button and then your video is gonna download in background uh, and while it is doing that I want to show you some of the other cool features you got um, so here this is your uh, this is basically your toolbar where you can uh, and this is very easy to edit you're just gonna click the manage your toolbar things here then you get your toolbar options um, and then you get your recommended apps, search notifications, and uh, advanced settings. And you can just play around with this, but I want to show you how to use it very, very fast. Um, so what you get here is the email with a and uh, radio play and Facebook notifications. Um, and uh, let's say I want to add Facebook, so I'm just going to click show uh, and then click OK. Then you can see it add, added my Facebook logo. For one, if I want to hide it again, I'm just going to click on hide hide and hide and um, depending on what I want to hide then click OK then you can see it hide it um, and you can also click here again click on a little plus down here ah, didn't work for me alright never mind then the cool thing about having um, an extended version of Google Chrome is that you get your Google Chrome options menu um, where you can edit, uh, edit your stuff here then you got your personal stuff under the hood, extensions, and storage settings. And uh, if you want some Google Chrome extensions, just click on get more extensions. Um, then you can download some extensions from uh, the Chrome web store, like games and uh, useful features. Like, uh, I don't know if Angry Birds is a useful feature, but uh, it's kind of a fun game and it's completely free. And you can also download Dropbox, which I really, really recommend. It's also, you get 2 gigabytes absolutely for free. And I never seen the service down, so I recommend downloading that extension. Um, all right, but the next thing I want to show you, um, actually, the next thing I want to uh, talk about is uh, uh, the browser experience. This is the basically the most important thing of your browser. Uh, <coughs> so the browser experience uh, for me has been really really good. Uh, I never had a I never had a break and down with the browser. Uh, you can see the scrolling is really really smooth. Don't know if you can see it on the recording, but the scrolling is really really smooth compared to Internet Explorer as I got down here or Safari on my Mac. Even though my Mac is really really powerful, still lacking in scrolling sometimes. Um, uh, the bad thing about this, if your mouse, if your mouse like I got on my Samsung a laptop, is more touch, it aren't supported by the Torch browser. You might you might be able to download an extension, but I couldn't find any. And didn't got it to work, so I can basically just I can open the my Internet Explorer Win browser, and you can see I can zoom in and out. But you can see it's lagging more when I'm scrolling. But uh, if you only are using a normal mice or mouse, I strongly I wouldn't see it as a big problem. That's the only problem I had with the touch browser so far. Uh, every every time, uh, let's say Adobe gonna 
release a new version of the Adobe Flash Player, you're gonna get it because you only are running an extended version of Full Chrome. So that was basically the end of the video. Please like, subscribe, and comment um, uh, because it's gonna mean a lot to us. And uh, also comment if you want us to do something like a tutorial or review. Um, we're gonna try to do it as soon as we can. And uh, we're gonna try to respond in all comments. Okay, but see you guys later. Bye.